everybody, it's Mix Ray Ray. Oh, not Mix Ray Ray. That's my other channel. It's Miss Ray Ray. Hello, everybody. Um, so, big surprise. The first running of this video, the first part one, got a copyright strike on YouTube because it's a Capcom game, which I forgot how Capcom was like. So, that's my bad. I need to go talk to Mr. Elderly? Wasn't he here? Was I supposed to go... Was I supposed to talk to him first before anything? I am in a lot of trouble then, aren't I? I feel like I learn that, like, relatively soon. Because I do remember in like the title sequence or something that I learned that. Let's listen. I feel it. I sense it. Foul beasts dwell in this place. Concentrate. Look hard. You see. Right behind you now. Oh, darn it. Wait, it was... Why? Cool. I like completely forgot how to fight. I do this like once a week. Gosh, how oh, you're rude. And it was actually because of these guys I got a copyright shock. <laughs> like I don't know, I guess like them being out here is like, oh my god. That's ours. You can't deny it. I'm like, I'm not trying to. I'm not even making money off of any of this. I'm doing it because it's fun. Humans are not witness to such battles, but I saw it. Are you not human? The fighting went on for exactly 26 seconds. Thanks. I need to go talk to the mayor guy. I kind of left him on read, like, to his face. Which is an impressive thing to do, but I'm also a dog. So I think I need to go find him before I talk to anybody else. Are those pumpkins? I feel like those are pumpkins, but I don't remember if pumpkins were like native to Japan. Nepal, which this place is canonically at. Nope, not there. Um, I guess I didn't talk to the mayor first, but oops. No water. Ooh, she angry. Why is she angry? Oh, she's Mrs. Orange. That's the mayor. I don't know if it's a mayor. Didn't he say he was like a chief or something? I can't remember. A white wolf. Now that's a rare sight. Did you come down from the mountains just to play with us? Well, you'd better be careful, dear. Lately, some monsters have been attacking the village. Do you know who you're talking to, Grim? <laughs> this here Shirinui. It's gonna take me a while to remember these names every time I have to restart this. Reborn. The wolf and I have it covered. These monsters are history. Well, if it isn't, it's soon. And riding a wolf, are we? This one certainly resembles Shirinui, especially the nose. Especially the nose. Okay. Hmm. Well, I'd better get back to work. Mumble, mumble. Oh, she's singing! And chores frustrate her. Okay. So, that's new. But I also need to find... Sheesh, he's always snoring like a bear. This is the home of the two-bit middle-aged warrior Susano. He goes around claiming to be a descendant of Nagi. He's famous around here for his lineage, but he's awfully lazy and too off the wall to be a descendant of a legendary hero. Hey, look, a bir bird. Hmm. I might need to change some settings for myself. Nope. Hmm. Is it this one? Yeah, it's this one. Okay. Cool. 
cool. So, up, down, left, right. Cool. I figure because, like, I'm just used to all this by now. Ooh. Is that a sword? Those are some fun swords. Are these the swords he trains with? They're all rusty and don't look like they've been used in years. Ooh, yeah, that bad. Ooh, there's a chest over there. I can't jump that far. And apparently I can't swim. Oh, I'm made of stone. Okay, that makes sense. Maybe... Oh, and it's already... S it's time works in here. That's different. I got... Maybe he's at the top of the mountain again? Oh, I forgot. Yeah, birds can, like, love me or something. Ooh, there's a thing. And there's another thing. Those, like, flowers or something? I want to go see where the dude is. Oh, yeah, no. See, those birds love me. And... Yes, he is all the way up here. I left him... Like, hunched over. And now it's nighttime. And where the crap did he go? Is this a ninja village? Ugh. <sighs> Darn it. I bet it would be easier if I just jumped off of the rock, but I don't want to. Is it different at night? It must be. Everyone must have a different kind of, like, night cycle. I don't have to, like, fight more on people unnecessarily, right? And then everyone's gonna be asleep, aren't they? I'm not gonna have anyone to talk to. Hmm. Nope. Nobody be here. Hmm. Well, he's not snoring now. Nope. Okay, he is. Can we go inside? <gasps> we can. Nope. It says no camera movement. Can I howl? I can still jump. I don't even know where he is. Is he a place where I can't see? Oh, he's down there. So he'd be not disturbed. Jump. Oh, I wanted to jump on him. Darn it. Susano. I am the greatest. Oh, Kushi, let's mumble, mumble, mumble. Well, it looks like he ain't waking up anytime soon. He's out cold. He was sleeping all day! Ooh. No, that's a spider web. I thought that was like a sigil or something. You'd think a dog like in your... Okay, well. Yep, out cold. Not gonna do anything. Hmm. Thank you for... Make it to where I don't have to see myself climbing up the ladder. As cool as that is, as I know dogs can do. I guess I should go this way then? There's a thing. And a very mysterious person. Oh, it's a merchant. I've been trying to get this darn rock to move, but I've tried myself out so much I'm starting to hear things now. Something evil is definitely afoot. Okay. So this one is... Are they all based off of, like, baboons or something? Ugh. Oh, 
Right, it's Y. I keep forgetting it's Y. I thought I could do like a sort of ink strike. Do I have to have like a specific thing to do that? He already did. So that was not needed. You accumulated praise. Yay! Whoa, Amy, you started you start you suddenly started glowing. That means your divine attributes can be enhanced. Because I'm glowing. Oh, thank you for that. No one ever tells me that. Well, you sure look excited. Here, I'll show you what I mean. Let's take a stab at enhancing your divine attitude. So I'm still in the tutorial a little bit. Still have to tell me how things go. I'm going to open the fan menu. I already know what the fan menu is. Use the praise you've accumulated to enhance your attributes you want. Oh, to accumulate. Oh. Oh. Candy pouch for holding coins. Ooh, astral pouch. Saves an terror from death if full. I like to be saved from death. I don't think I need it yet. I have 55. Solar energy displays Amatatero's life energy. It displays it. Ink pot displays amount of, okay, so I can get more life. More ink, um, death immunity, or holding coins. Holding more coins. Hold, um, I guess, uh, let me think. Cool. Aw, I can only use like a little bit at a time. Nope. Okay. Well, is it all coming back to you or what? Huh? It's hard to know such a small enhancement. I'll lighten up for a So I am talking. The only person who can understand me is a flea. I guess that fits. I am technically a dog spirit. There's one big stop for the new and improve my to sit. Keep up the good work. Oh, I almost forgot. We better check in on something. The merchant, I guess? Ah, that's better. My head's clear now. I just wish I could do something about this boulder. No one in the village seems to want to help out, though. Say, pup, your owner lives here in the village, right? So you must know what that guy Susano. Can you get him to come here? They say he's the descendant of the legendary hero Nagi. If anyone can do something about this rock, it's him. That's strange. This boulder wasn't here before. You're just gonna, just gonna sit there staring at a rock. Okay, so that was this one. Um. Ooh, I jump high. Now, can I wake him up with some barking? I feel like that would be the funniest thing to do. Can I, like, howl? Please let me howl in his no ear. Snoring. I am the greatest. Uh, la, la, la. Let's wake this guy up. Aw, I wanted... What the? Huh? I really wanted to wake him up by howling in his ear. You know, like my dogs try to do. I feel so rested. <coughs> I planned to meditate underground, but fell asleep. Huh, who are you? And what business do you have with Susana, the greatest warrior ever? The greatest warrior, Susana. Look at his eyes! He has such cutesy eyes! I love it. 
Do you even... Do even the beasts know of my great exploits now? Well, Fido, I'm not looking for apprentices. Go back to the mountains and play with your monkey friends. Rude! How dare a mangy mutt like you interrupt my meditation? Get low this guy, all brown, no brains. Is his hat a beetle? Like, literally a hat beetle? Oh my god, I love it. Quit messing around and come with us. Hm, you snuck in here again. Quit bugging me, you, you bug. I told you, don't call me a bug. Come on, Amy, we're taking him with us. What do you think you're doing? Put me down. This instant. What will the neighbors think? Ah, sorry. I got distracted by like this. Oh, he's like scared when I'm doing it. Hey, someone called for you. So come on. More cutscene. You made you met. You brought me all the way here just to test yourself against me. Then prepare to taste the wrath of my trusty blade. I didn't get the name. I'm. Hold on a minute. You're the legendary Susano? Yep, none other than Susano, the greatest warrior who ever lived. And by the way, never interrupt uh, warriors engaged in battle. But I've got a favor to ask you. This huge boulder blocking the path is really getting in my way. Can't you do something about it? What? Come on, please. I mean, you're Nagi's descendant, aren't you? Surely one of the stones no match for your mighty skills, right? Um, it is certainly not beyond my ability. Really? Great. Okay then, no time like the present. Go for it. Wait, a boulder of this size is not very easy even for me. This will require my utmost focus to magnify the power of my sword. I shall retire to the training grounds to make preparations. Wait for my return. Hmm, I wonder. I've never seen that guy train seriously, ever. Can that guy really handle this? Oh well, I guess all I can do is wait here. Um, there's like a gap. <clears throat> there's like a gap right there. I mean... There's like a gap right here too. Can I do something about it? Like... Nope. Nope, I can't. So I gotta go get that guy to like do something. Is he? Oh, he's back here. And asleep. Huh. Could he really be a descendant of Nagi? I am also asking that. Oh, yay. Now it's nighttime. And he's decided to drink. I know I told that merchant I could help. But a boulder of that size? I don't care if I'm of a legendary bloodline, it's just too big. Hmm? Oh no, I can't believe I've run out of sake at a time like this. This won't do one bit. That's it for today, I'll just have to train tomorrow. That's... It's no use, I can't even move. You're, like... Mm. Can't train without sake to fuel the fire. You drank all the sake. You should have all of the fuel. Training will just have to wait till tomorrow. Why do today what you can put off until tomorrow? That's doing things the Sasano way. Ha 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 ha. Saki, does he really think we're gonna bring him some Saki? I don't think he was asking us to. He just thinks we're a dog. But hey, I can go talk to the dude now. I just gotta, you know, be quiet. That might have been disrespectful not going through like the whole actual gate. I don't got a choice this time. I'm not gonna talk to you. I don't wanna fight people again. Hmm. Aw, oh, these birdies like me, at least. Yay! Oh wait, I can swim, I forgot. Okay. You. 
Mr. Orange. You, you're that unruly white wolf. That was quite a toss you gave me. Well, white one, I respect animals and their customs. But anyone who causes trouble in this village shall be dealt with harshly. You are a spunky little thing, aren't you? <laughs> Hello, Mr. Orange. Still full of vim and vigor, I see. Say, aren't you that little troublemaker, Isun? If, you, if I've told you once, I've told you a thousand times. Ah, uh, never mind. I got better things to do. Oh, hello again. That tree is known as Konohana. She's been worshipped as our guardian deity for ages now, but her flowers and fruit withered quite some time ago. What's more, I had a dreadful dream last night. A giant monster appeared and swallowed up the whole village. Might it be a sign of even worse things to come? No, it means I saved her. I sure would like to see Konohana restored to her former glory. Oh well, troublemakers like you couldn't possibly understand. Is he talking to Isun or me? He barely knows me. Can I... Okay, well. Jump. Oh, I forgot. I can, like, feed birds, can't I? I think I have to, like, stop and be near them, though. I don't want to bite. I guess I don't have any food for them. Okay, so... Maybe I have to go talk to the merchant again? About some sake. He is a merchant. All I see these people do is farm and a child running. So maybe the merchants sell sake? Oh, rabbits! Hi, little bunnies. Do I don't want to bite them. That's rude. They're my little bunnies. Get along, by a little bunny. Who the heck put this big rock here? It's blocking the only road out of the village. <clears throat> Doesn't look like you could squeeze through anywhere. I saw two giant gaps that I could definitely squeeze through. Besides, I don't even know if it's safe to leave the village yet. Hmm, you know, what do I do? I talked to the old lady. Is there like more sake in here or something that he's hiding? A broken sword, that's rude. Hmm. Well, there's definitely only boulders and stuff up here. So then... Where would I go for someone to deal with Susano? Oh, they like me! Hi! <clears throat> Yushi. Oh, hey, she has, um, what are those called? It's like lotus sponge thingies. Well, what a fine looking wolf. What's your name? Mine's Kushi. It's a pleasure to meet you. Oh, hey, that's the dude that, or that's the lady that the dude was talking about. Working in the fields again, are you? Oh, soon. Are you and the wolf together? This is where I grow the rice for making my sake. You know. But I have to manage the harvest all on my own. It's hard work. Maybe I should have Susana give me a hand again this year. Oh, listen to me blabbering on. <clears throat> I just can't help chatting to you. Why, Amy, I think I found a friend here. <clears throat> I don't, sorry. It's like super early in the morning. And my throat feels funny. You'll meet many people who want to talk to you like this. You should talk to them two or three times. Being a good, being gone at all, you can actually tell when to talk. Because you'll see a triangle above their heads. That means they still have something to say. Might even be valuable information. Okay, they may be muttering to themselves, but it play, pays to listen. Okay, like, hi, can I... Oh, hello there. I've got a bit of a problem, you know? I have to polish the rice in the mill house before I can use it. But the mill's broken. 
A wicked monster broke it the other day. It's hopeless trying to do... It's, she needs her meal fixed. <laughs> well, that's too bad. I should never have let that monster try to my fender brew. Why? Are you the only one who's nice to monsters in this village? A broken mill and flattened crops, that's all the thanks I get. Don't go giving monsters sake, they're bad enough sober. Sheesh, what was she thinking? Anyway, I guess this is a matter of fixing something that's broken. Sounds like something you could handle with your brush, Amy. Fair? You have to be on the other side. To like, see it as a whole. I think that would be better. Why? Yay! I fixed it! And my nose is still running, what the heck? What's this? The mill's been mended? Who on earth did that? Ah, ah. Sorry. Hanky. Nose. Running. I'd completely given up on the idea of making my sake. But now I can get on with polishing the rice. Yes, I completely gave up on my dream. Or my profession because of one small- well, not small. Because of one big thing that I could just have waited to fix. A little salty. Well, no time like the present. I better get started. I wonder how Susana would have felt if he realized if it stayed broken. Absolutely how he would never have been able to drink sake again. I'm gonna go talk to other villagers while I think she's waiting. A white wolf? Now that's just plain weird. Sure looks like a weak little bugger. Think you could beat my dog Hayabu? Hayab he has a dragonfly on a string like it's a pet. Well, listen to this. There's this field my mom attends to, you see? Well, Hayabusa managed to dig up ten turnips in a row, even though my mama was chasing him around trying to slug him. There are actually ten turnips in that field. Hayabusa is fixed and get all ten. Okay. I've had just about enough of this. I don't know if it's stray dogs or monsters or what, but someone keeps messing up my crops. <laughs> Going around digging holes with X, it makes me mad. If I catch you digging around here, you'll get a good thumping. You didn't come all the way out here to find food, did you? Well, as long as you don't start digging holes with X. <clears throat> you can do what you want as far as I'm concerned, okay? Something about food, and then, well, as long as you don't start digging holes, you can do whatever you want. Okay, so. X? Aww. You consumed a turnip. Tuber is crisp texture. Feels astral pack. Ah! Nope. Ha ha ha. You can't get me. I'm doing this like right in front of you. Nope. You can't thump me. You can't catch me. Nope. Just gotta keep digging.
at six. I am doing this really dumb mini game for no reason. And I just realized I've been silent for most of it, except for like colorful commentary. Ooh, this one's gonna be harder, they're all like next to each other. Ha ha ha. Oh, hey, I got that one without even like. That's nine. Oop. Hey, rune. Aww. Okay, nine, that's true. There's only one turnip to concentrate on. I can't keep running away from them. I'm not gonna bite the dog. Okay. Is this lady has more to talk about? Here to listen to the ramblings of an old woman, are you? Well, I was doing the laundry, but when it was ready to dry, I noticed my drying pole was gone. Oh, whatever shall I do? Where did the darn pole go? How could something important like that just disappear? Hmm, she's missing something that should be there, is she? You better help her out. Okay. Um... What is that? Can I jump up there? <coughs> Bless me. Jeez. Okay, well, I'm not gonna... Is this where... Yeah. Saki house. They say Saki's so good that people come as far as the capital to buy it. Okay. This must be where she make where she ages the sake. Smell good, doesn't it? Okay. Okay. Get it. It's not ready. How does something so small as like a sake house take a loading sign for the screen? I'm pretty much stuck here. Can't train without Saki. Training will just have to wait until tomorrow. Doing things to Saki on our way. Hmm. Oh yeah. This village girl has... This village has a Saki brewing girl, doesn't it? Yeah, we established that, Isun. she done with it yet? I think she's in the mill, right? Is there a door into the mill? Yes. Okay, you done? You're interested in how to brew sake, are you, Snowy? Well, this thing here is for polishing the rice, you see. Oh, I'll tell you what, I've got something I think you'll like. It's just some leftover stock from the store, but I made it myself. It's called Vista of the Gods. Oh, but are you even old enough to drink? Like, I don't... I don't want to bite it. Can I talk to you? Oi. Okay. Cool. Brewing sake is my whole life, you know? One day I'll produce sake that'll be recommended and remembered in Legend Forever. I consumed rice balls. That was not... Balls of rice wrapped in seaweed. Okay, cool. That was not my intention. Now I gotta just go take this to the guy. And hopefully none of it gets like sloshed around. Dude, here's your stupid sake. It's not stupid, I'm just, I, Hold it right there, Fido. That spell. Is that Kushi's famous home brewed sake? You offered Vista of the Gods. Fido, my friend, did you bring me some... Uh, yes. What a glorious day. Good old sake. A man without drink is like a warrior without his trusty sword. You have a rusty sword. You have a wooden sword. It's splintered. In fact, it is said Nagi himself relied on the power of sake in his battle with the dreaded Orochi. It's all so clear now. Let the training begin. 
I'll just try a bit of my usual routine. Okay, here I come. Oops. Hmm. You should not get off so easy next time, dummy. I didn't know I was supposed to help him. Try again. Mentally prepare, here I come. Okay, 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 I got it this time. There we go. Feast your eyes on this. Sasano style. Exploding implosion. Hopefully I don't get him. Oh wait, no, why? I keep forgetting. A is such a natural... Wait. Jeez. There we go. Huh? Yeah. He's like so excited that it worked for once. Susano style. Exploding implosion. And it just disappears. But that's amazing. You slice that huge rock clean in half. You really are something. Wow, I didn't think you could <clears throat> do it, Pops. Hmm. Me either. <laughs> or, I mean, of course I could. He's such, like, kind eyes for someone who's, like, a lazy bum. After all, I am Susana, the greatest warrior ever. You weren't just showing off when you said you're Nagi's descendant. You said he was Nagi's descendant. He was saying he couldn't do the boulder. Someone like you'd have no trouble fighting off monsters, huh? Well, anyway, thanks a lot. Now I can start doing business again. Did you say m m monsters? Oh, um, of course, no problem. This is a job for the m most skilled warrior in all of Nippon. Yes, I shall rid these lands of your vile presence. Just sit back and watch the great Sasano work his magic. Oh, he did. He should get all puffed up. He's nothing without us. Think he'll be okay? The monsters outside the village are nasty. Ah, glorious Amatasero. Is that a... Is that a peach on her bum? What a pleasure to witness your heroic deeds. I am in awe. When you cleaved the boulder in two, my heart skipped a beat. To see your skills with the brush is to be witness to great art. Yeah, so do we get a reward or something, lady? I hardly think your participation had any impact, little bug. Everyone keeps calling him Bug, and he's really annoyed by it. It's Isn't Isn't Isn't. Stop calling me a bug. I'll crawl back into your- Okay, that's gross. My word. Oh, relax, lady. Furball here is more comfy anyway. And yeah, it's fur and you're... a flea? Let's get back to that reward thing you were talking about. Come on, Amy, put your paw up or something. Go on, shake. I must apologize. I would like to reward you, but I'm afraid I haven't the power. I can barely muster enough strength to make a flower bloom. Though my body stands firmly here, within the confines of the village, my roots spread far and wide, protecting remote areas outside. These parts of me are known as guardian saplings. Oh, those things. They collect the praise and adoration that gives me strength. The recent evil is eroding the guardian saplings. If this continues, I will wilt away as well, and my power will vanish. Worse yet, the dark power grows stronger with each passing day. Life as we know it will be consumed utterly in no time. Aw, man. This is getting heavy. <laughs> Great and powerful Matsutero. 
Could you be so bold at can I be so bold as to request your assistance in rejuvenating these guardian saplings by lifting the curse that enslaves them? <laughs> I shall mark the locations of nearby saplings on your map. That I just happen to have. I don't remember getting a map. Is that like all of Japan? Okay. I have grown tired. I haven't even the strength to speak now. That is definitely a peach on her butt. Okay, I hope that my request is not fallen on deaf ears. Matsuzero, may the fresh scent of flowers protect you always. Bah. I'm always itching for a good fight, but I sure don't want to poke my nose into this mess. Still, I'm stuck with furball here until I get all of the brush skills. That was your plan. Anyway, Amy's a god and all. What could possibly go wrong? Stop saying that. Jeez. A surprise like the screen didn't immediately go black when you said that. Hey, did you listen to her? Stop. I want to play a game. Okay, yes. Get the rest of the brush techniques to save the world. And I'll steal and learn them. Yeah, that's the ticket. At any rate, let's start by following those marks on the map. Okay, cool. We have our next- oh hey, look, merchant person. The boulder was literally just like right here. You could have just set up next to him. What are you selling? Okay then, guess I better offload some stock before heading back. Feel free to take a look if you've been sent to do the shopping pup. Yes? Oh. Exorcism slip. I have... Oh, I have some money. Okay. Feedback. Hmm. Okay, well. Ooh, it's getting dark. I wonder what will happen if I go back to the tree. Will something bad happen? There's like purple flames all around it. Oh, around like the shrine entrance. Does that mean like if I get close it's gonna, just gonna turn back to like the thing? Yes. Yes, it does. Hmm. What if I go around? Hey! That's exactly what that was about. Holy snucky. Okay. Hi. How can I help you? Wow, a white wolf. I thought the statue of Shiranui had disappeared. But you look just like it. And didn't just come to life, did it? Hey sis, the dog's got something weird on its back. What? Stop being silly. That's how rumors start. Aww. The kitty, the little cat, the kid. The child. After that nonsense about seeing a door of light here before. But I did. I did see it. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Oh. Right inside the shrine, there was a door of light. Oh, hey, is that... The statue of Nagi was erected to protect the village, you see? It's located even deeper in Shiranui Shrine. They must really revere him, but still, wasn't there an even bigger statue of him around here? Kind of. Ooh, what if I went... Nope, okay, that isn't, that's not how it works. It's nighttime, and I guess I need to go... Wait a minute, where was... There we go. Um, zoom out. Ah, oh, darn it. Okay, well I kind of got an idea of where it was. So... Which time? Actually, sorry, I'm left-handed. Okay, I have a little bit of time. We can see... What's on that map I need to go see. 
Okay. I guess I should go see if Sasan is dead. Like the little rainbow light. Let me just. Yep. Jump right into it. Oop. Yep. Shinshu. Shinshu field. Ooh, everything's all black and miasmy. Uh, you probably know this already, Amy, but this here is Shinshu Field, the most beautiful field in Nippon. At least it's supposed to be. Ever since that incident, I've been getting a bad, bad vibe. We better watch where we're going. You can look at the map by holding down ZL. Right, left. Okay. Let's pay attention to the map as we push ahead. Ooh, that where I be. Okay. Ooh, look at all. Ooh, I can't. Okay, I can kind of move. But, okay. Evil scroll. I kind of remember that. Can they see me? Or do I just have to, like, walk into them? Amy, that's the first guardian sapling marked on our map. Oh, there. It's supposed to be a place for travelers to rest and recuperate. But just look at it. It looks like it could fall over any moment. Oh, this place is definitely cursed from the looks of it. Places where evil has taken hold, luring monsters from far and wide, are known as cursed zones. But I've never seen one this big. It's withered all the plant life in the area, even that big tree. I'd take a, I'd take a monster with powers beyond even a god. Oh, it'd take a monster with powers beyond a god to do this. I guess God is just a title. That tree is an offshoot of Sakuya. It protects nature in the area. Maybe the natural beauty here would return if we revived it. But how the heck do we do that anyway? So, get to the tree. Is that the dog yawning? That was adorable. Ooh, there's a person in need of comfort. Nope. You are just like just beyond. Can I? Another statue? Has everyone here turned to statues? Or to stone? I guess that's what happened when you fall in the curse. They must have been struck by some terrible curse. The only way to help them is get rid of this cursed evil. He statue. He a statue. Okay. Examine. When you look at that, Amy, this guardian sapling is a wreck. So that's why Sakuya is hurting so bad. I bet the natural beauty will return if you revive that tree. How could you possibly do something like that? You need a special power that could make a withered tree blossom. Like water? Oh look, more people. In a cursed zone. Okay. Nope, wrong. Wrong button. Okay. Daylight time, I guess. Kamiki Village. <laughs> I really wish that, like, signs would get, would do that. Like, actual, like there would be actual signs like that. That would be amazing. Okay, so. Examine Tuhana Valley. Let me go back to the village. I remember seeing, like, little blossomy flower things. And I wonder if I am, if I, if I can access those yet. Do you know like the little pink, peachy, flowery, bloomy things? They were like part of the cutscene. They were like, hey, so I 
have saplings everywhere, but they were showing like the flowers, which were that thing. I guess I can't access those yet. Do those help me like jump or something? What are those supposed to be? Or maybe I'm just supposed to go over and like fight scrolls and... <clears throat> Come on, let me just... I wonder what would happen if I did... Well, I mean, obviously I'd just fight them, but... Hmm... Let me just fight one. If I fight one, will it attract others? So those things summon like monsters to fight. They don't actively seek me out. Why? Nope. One scroll. Did it help any? Not particularly. Will I turn into a statue if I go into the cursed land? No. Holy cow, this is bad. It looked like your regular old curse zone from back there. But the evil here is far worse close up. It would curse a normal person in a flash. I'm afraid it might even rob you of your power. Okay. That did seem pretty bad. Maybe I just need to go back to the village they were talking about? Hana village. So those scrolls don't really seek me out. But hey, there's a person that's not a statue. Nameless man. Nice name. What just happened? I was out here chopping wood and continue and communing with nature as usual when I heard a loud rumbling like an earthquake from the lake. Then a huge gust of wind blew up out of nowhere. I don't know what happened next, but when I came to it was like this. My art workshop was just across the stream there, but it something vanished and then this cursed zone appeared. The earth must be angry. All I want is to live with nature in peace, man, but now I can't. I noticed a figure running from the lake towards Kamiki. Whoever it was, man, I hope Mother Earth kept them safe. What's up, nature buddy? Curious about that cave? It's the entrance to a place called Hana Valley. Hana? It's probably Hana. The site of an amazing waterfall, but monsters have moved in now. There's a trippy crystal ball that makes plants grow enshrined there. Oh, hey. That can probably help the tree. You'd think gardeners would be flocking here for it. Actually, not long ago, that Susano guy went marching in there. It's weird, normally he runs away at the sight of monsters. And he and he hardly seems the type to try his hand at gardening. Anyway, it's bad karma, man. You could be attacked if you went in. Okay, well, obviously we have to go there. Ooh, the water's all gushy now. That's bad. Come on. We gotta get in there. Hana Valley. Ooh, it all spooky. This is a spooky one. I'm just gonna, like, save right here. Yes. Um, uh, main quest, so I'm gonna save here. If I have different paths I want to take, then I'll do the multiple saves. Um, actually, since this is a new area and I can tell I haven't missed anything yet, I still want to learn how to do the whole, like, windy wave thing. I'll probably learn that here, because he was talking about big gusts of wind. Um, I'll, I'm, I'm, 
I'm going to leave this episode here for now. Thank you guys so much for sticking with me until now, um, up until now. I keep saying now. Thank you guys so much for staying with me. I really do appreciate it. And hopefully I don't have to keep taking parts of this video like out or anything because this will continue to be copyright stroke. Um, not that I'm making money off of any of it, but like if it's to just be like fight scenes in here or something, I will probably have to stop playing Akami. Um, I'll look into like maybe if I could stream it on Twitch, but like Twitch is also still getting like DMCA'd or whatever. So we'll just have to see. Um, if not, I can find something else to play. I mean, how many games? There's like millions of games out there. Not millions, but a lot. So um, thank you and I'll see you next time.